Right, so last night I watched the new Wham! documentary on Netflix. Before this, I was just a casual fan. You know, you drink a beer at a Christmas party while dancing awkwardly with work colleagues. But this documentary has given me a profound sense of respect for this 80s pop band. I love how it portrayed the group as perpetually frozen in time as young men. We never get to see them as a middle-aged entity. This seals the fun of it into a time capsule. Everyone knows George Michael's solo work in the 80s and 90s, but what I found fascinating here was understanding how a young man became an icon. The film really gives you an insight into how a nerdy kid struggled with his insecurities, but ultimately broke through them. I was captivated by the respect from his peers at the time like Elton John, people who could see through the teeny pop wham aesthetic and just what an exceptional songwriter George was. It showcases Andrew Ridgely as more than just the other guy in Wham and the influence he had on instilling confidence in George. His grace in knowing that the band had to fold for George to fulfil his destiny was beautiful. He was happy for his friend and not selfish or resentful. I have a newfound respect for Wham and they'll be on my Spotify all weekend.